Hi guys, welcome to a new vlog. I just got out of a spin class and went to Starbucks, obviously. I actually ordered inside because I needed to get a little gift card for my friend Kyra. Today is like her birthday party. So yeah, I just wanted to get her a little something. I already got her a belt bag, which that was like her main gift, but this is for her uh, like birthday, just so I can like bring something, I guess. And I know she loves Starbucks and will definitely use it. I also wanted to try this new drink and I was watching this girl named Sophia's like her vlogs about iPhones because it's iPhone season. And I watched like some, one of her Starbucks vlogs or something and she said to order this. It's the, it's a grande cold brew with two pumps of vanilla and soy milk. So I'm hoping this is good. It has everything that I like, so I don't know why I wouldn't like it. I haven't really had soy milk though, so fingers crossed this is good. Mmm, okay. The best way I can describe it is like chocolate coffee. I don't know why it has like that taste of like chocolate, even though it says vanilla. It's not bad, I'm glad I tried it. It's been a while since I've tried like Starbucks drinks. Now I have some errands to run and the first and I have to run. I have to go to um, the pharmacy to pick up some medications for a mother. But guys, I sold my Canon G7X. Um, it's only because I want the Mark II, but yeah, this baby finally sold and I'm gonna go to the post office today because the person who bought it wanted it as a birthday present and she was like, will I get it before Thursday or like on Thursday? Cause she needs it for like a birthday gift. And I was like, well, I can't guarantee that ma'am, but like, yeah, and then she asked if like I would negotiate with price and I was like, no, because I wanna put the money that I get from this one towards the Mark II because honestly, I just want an upgraded camera because the G7X is a lot more popular now and I've just been carrying this one a lot more recently to vlog because it's just easier than the M50. Like the M50 is huge, like I like it but it's just I love the wide angle but it's just a little too much um and then when I want to take pictures with friends too the g7x works out so I just kind of use it as like a double a double way to use things I don't know yeah I just want the new camera so for how much this sold I only have to pay like 200 and that's really good for like a camera I'll have to pay a little bit more than that because eBay took more than I expected like they take 13% of the item cost so I was like not really playing on that but it's not that much but still I raised the prices on some of my other items because I'm like okay now I know now I know it's been a hot minute since I've actually sold a big item on eBay so at least I know that now um, so I'll just like mark up the item 13% so I like make what I want to make on it but anyway yeah I have to drop this bad boy off at the post office now okay so to go along with my friend's gift, Kyra loves these cheddar chips. So I got her a big bag of those and a Starbucks gift card. So that goes along with her already belt bag. Cause I know she'll love both. I finished up the pharmacy run and I did my grocery shopping. Now I'm gonna head home. Well, hello there. All right, so I'm planning in my outfit to wear to my friend Kyra's birthday. I will have to share with you guys a conversation that actually transpired, but I think I'm gonna try to do like one of these bounding ideas because I really don't have any like SpongeBob costume. I was gonna do Mr. Krabs, but I was like, I don't know about all that because I could wear jeans with like red underneath. I might do that one, but since she said to bring the bathing suits and stuff, I'm thinking I'll just do Squidward. This was my SpongeBob idea, but I had nothing red for the top. I mean, I have some red beads, but that just doesn't make any sense. But I was gonna wear the black belt with this because like that's the color of his pants. I don't have anything yellow, honestly. Nothing yellow lives in this closet, so that was a no-go. But I'll show you guys. This was the inspiration for Squidward, this girl right here. So I think that pretty much matches. I think I'm satisfied with it because honestly, I didn't really realize it was gonna be dress up. And now I wanna share with you guys like what the conversation um, I had with my friends. So basically, I don't know why I find this so funny, but when I read it out loud, I'm probably gonna laugh even more. So she said, oh, it's dress up. And I was like dressing up as in fancy or like a costume because it's a SpongeBob theme party. So. I didn't really think about that at all when I was like thinking costume. I thought I could just wear whatever because Halloween is like you dress up in whatever and I'm like, I'm probably just gonna reuse one of the costumes I have. So she said costume uh, because I said fancier costume and then my other friend Jamie says, okay, sweet. 
And then I say, you'll love it, Kyra, because I was talking about her present that Jamie's getting her. And then um, Kyra said, oh, I'm excited. And then I say, okay, I guess I'll just wear some devil horns or a Mario hat because that's what I've just worn in the past. I think I got this whole devil costume um, because I thought I was gonna be a devil for Halloween and then I changed at the last minute because I wanted to be a alien. Yeah, I never ended up wearing the devil costume, so I still have it. Kyra said, I think I might just make something Mario hat with like skull emojis. And then she said, it's SpongeBob laughy face, laughy face. And before I got those messages, I said, yeah, LOL. And then, I said, oh shit, I have nothing. And then they're like both laughing. And I was like, I thought it was a little early for Halloween because again, costume, me thinking that the party is just like, you could dress up as whatever. And then she's like, girl, no. And I was like, sigh. And then she's like, it's my SpongeBob birthday party, LOL. I said this and I said, well, that's embarrassing. And then Kyra said, you're funny. I said, I know, but like when I hear dress up, I think fancy or Halloween. And then she was like, yeah, it makes sense. So basically I laughed for a good, probably half an hour at that conversation because that like went right over my head. And I think my costume is good for what it is. I was like, I'll just do like a bound and wear like some similar colors that a character wears. So I think this will be really good. I was gonna shower, but she was like, bring your bathing suit. So I don't know what I'm gonna do, honestly. I think I'll just shower because I wanna be comfortable and then I just won't get my hair wet if I do go in the pool. I just had to share that with you. I thought it was so funny. Also too, sold my camera and the lady was so nice. She was like, good luck with your new camera. I already miss it. I've had that camera since 2016 and I was doing the math. I've had that camera nearly seven years, even more so than the big camera I'm selling, the 70D. Like, I don't know, there's just something about the Canon G7X. We've had so many memories together. I mean, I had my first boyfriend with that camera and I would like vlog. I don't know, there's just like so much sentiment and that's probably why I've kept it for that long. And like when me and one of my friends, like she's an ex YouTuber now, like we would vlog and she has the same camera and it's just like so sad that I got rid of it. But just knowing I'm going to get like a new camera, just like it's gonna be the same camera, just upgraded to the Mark II. Like I have to just keep telling myself it's just the newer version because again, like I've had that one for so long and it still is like a perfect camera. I just want an upgrade because I'm now using it a lot more and I used it a lot in the past. So I just wanted an upgrade. I think it makes sense just because I am using the camera a lot more now. It was kind of just like a backup for a couple of years. And then now I'm like starting to really use it. Like when I go out, I'm gonna take that and just vlog on that rather than take this camera. Cause you best believe it. I'm not gonna be carrying this big thing around when I'm like going out and about. So, and then when I get my iPhone, like I'll vlog on that when I get my new one and or this one, I'll just vlog with this. Like once I'm stable in a job and I want to save up for the Sony one, like I will. I don't need it, you know? There's no need for that camera. I'm very happy with my decision to just get the G7X Mark II so I can have it for photo and video. And yeah, I'm gonna stop talking now. I'm definitely going to take this camera though to vlog at my friend's party. I don't know how much footage I'm gonna get. It's at someone's house that's not her house or like where she lives. So I don't wanna be like, uh, but I think I will like ask the owners like, hey, is it okay if like I just show like the decorations because I really want to. I'm gonna go shower now and take it easy before the party. I was thinking too, I also could be Plankton. I don't know if uh, my friend would want me to be her character though. Maybe she doesn't care, but um, we have a two-tone, we have an all green set that I could wear, but I like the contrast with the greens. Yeah, I might go with this too, because honestly, <laughs> this looks really bad when I wear a bra, but sometimes I just wear a bra because, because that's just really uncomfortable with like a strapless bra. So yeah, I don't know, haven't decided yet, but at least I have some options. Okay, so decided on this outfit because it's definitely just a lot more cooler temperature wise than the other outfit. I'm just gonna like put my hair over you know, if we take pictures or whatever. Squidward inspired outfit. <laughs> All right, so I made it and I'm allowed to vlog in here. I asked the owner of the house and yeah, this is Kyra, the birthday girl. You've seen her a million times. I got her, wait, show what I got. So she likes oh, yeah. the chips, she's already opened them. And then her little Starbucks gift card. 
but she's just showing me around. Oh, food. Chicken. Okay. Pork. Chickpea salad. Mac and cheese. Mac and cheese under this. Oh, okay. Potato salad. Wow. This is like Filipino noodles. It's really good. Okay. And then we got ribs. Nice. And then we got, I forget what this is called, but it's like cheese balls with um, tomatoes with like Italian dressing and stuff. Okay. And then we got coleslaw. Now this coleslaw is kind of weird. It's like spicy and sweet at the same time, but it's okay. like, it makes sense. And then we got, I'm pretty sure this is like refried greens. Okay. And we got the King's Hawaiian. Cool. And then we also got like the, the different dipping sauces and stuff like that. Okay. I think this is barbecue sauce, but this doesn't look like barbecue sauce. I don't know if the other ones are, but. Cool. But yeah, and then we also have these brownies over here. Ooh, gotta have to show um, the dessert. They're like short <laughs> or something. Yeah. Look at these plates. <laughs> Spongebob. Oh, All right, so the grand entrance is actually pretty grand because look at the little decor here. And then they have like a whole happy birthday thing. And this is a view. Like, look how cool. That's a grand entrance. And I got this parting gift. It's a pencil. What did you call this? A doodle bop thing? Oh, it's a doodle bop pencil. A doodle bop pencil. We got some more decor over here. This is kind of like their living room area, but I wanted to show you. Look at the SpongeBob plate. Obviously, because it's a SpongeBob theme party. We got SpongeBob here. Hello. The decor is like great. It's a, I'm impressed. Kitty, stop! Look how cute this cat is. Aww. He's so cute. Also, I want to show you guys they have a whole entire pool table. That'd be really fun to play. Not gonna lie. Say hi to the vlog. Okay, tell them what your costume is. And look, there's a, the cat again. Heart, sorry, distraction here. Okay. Hey guys, I'm Mr. Krabs. <laughs> And I'm also chowing down on mac and cheese and potatoes. Don't judge. This is my second helping, but it's fine. She's living her best life. Brought my own wine. And actually, I taught Jamie how to play Cards Against Humanity, adult game, but I think she would really like it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I just wanted to include Jamie because, yeah. <laughs>